Gregory Iron. I just want to say, on behalf of my father's legacy and all the welterweights and athletes in the back, congratulations. My father would truly be ashamed that you were allowed in that ring. What? Oh. What? Wow. You are a disgrace to all the professional athletes in independent wrestling. Because of your disabilities, you could have got someone hurt out there. <laughs> In my father's age, they would have chewed you up and spit you out. Come on now. That's enough, Brian. You see, they don't just let anybody into the wrestling business, or they used to not. Now they just let anybody in. Telling it like it is. Where's this coming from? Maybe I should introduce you to a real athlete, someone who's trained under the likes of Lance Storm, someone who actually paid their dues oh. Oh, no, and no. can operate both arms. Oh, no. That, that, that's Jackson Argos. Oh. What? I'm sorry. Argos, a star in the Tri-State area. Jackson. Jackson Argos, apparently. You're not a welterweight. You're a waste of weight. Come on now. You're a disgrace. This is completely uncalled for. Jackson. Oh, no, no, not the crutch. Not the crutch. Stop this. Junior showing in shades of the old man here. This is completely out of line. You knew you had to have This is what we do to people that don't belong in the ring. Brian's taking the legacy of his father a little too far here. Oh, that's. That's Iron's maneuver. Argos does it as well. He calls it the brainstorm. <laughs> Joe, can you believe what we're witnessing here? Greg did nothing to deserve this. Not a Brian thing. Brian Tillman Jr. stepping out of the shadows. Come He's on. his own man. He's his own man. Come on. Him. Come on. This is completely uncalled for. Make sure he never comes back. This is a statement. Ryan Pillman's like a loaded gun out here. Two men bonded by the same trainer, and I got hit in the skull with a crutch. Oh, Completely uncalled for. Come on, somebody stop this. This is disgusting. Joe, you should be respecting Brian Pillman. You gave the man a plaque, an award for his father. Pillman is smiling at this. Pillman is smiling. I told you, he's a loaded gun. Pillman feeling his father's legacy was disrespected by, to me, the most inspirational welterweight. Thank you, Jackson. We will restore wrestling to its former glory, disposing of one imbecile at a time. <laughs> this is disgusting. No. No! Oh! <laughs> What's the matter with you? Wow. Finally. Now I respect everyone in the audience tonight. I respect all of the athletes in the back, but I have no respect for someone who would allow this man to be in a ring. That means you, Joe. I do not respect That's you, it. Booker Man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the apple doesn't fall far from the tree, does it, Zimbrowski? If I may. Take notice, you are looking at two men trained by the incredible Lance Storm in Calgary, Alberta, Canada. So give it up one more time. Brian Pillman. This is not why he was brought here. Oh, this but it's better. It's better. Completely over the line. Get out of here. The rogue horseman rides. <laughs> respect him, Joe. Show these men respect. Joe, you should be bowing. This, this is just tasteful. We need some effect.
Oh, it's about time. This is, um, that's uncomfortable. I, Aaron, I was crying. Aaron, what, what do you make of this? This I didn't see this coming. I, I, I sensed it's the a coming of age I for Brian Pillman. Listen, I sensed a dismissive tone in Brian when he talked I about Greg it. through this matchup, but I never thought it could resort to this. Hey, look, what did you think about the old man, about Brian Pillman Sr.? Loose cannon, right? Yeah, yeah, no, you're so right. So you expected something else? 